What? Uh, why does my character look like this? Um, it's been a long time since I last played. Is this another way the game punishes me for not playing? Because I wouldn't be surprised. Why do I look like this? Why? It has been a month since I last played. I am so sorry. A lot of things happened. Let's see. One week my parents visited and I couldn't record then because they're very loud and it's a small apartment. Um, next week I got, um, I got sick. And then I had an assignment due for school, an essay, and I hadn't been able to work on it while I was sick. And then I had my exam. So yeah, I uh, didn't record for a long time. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> but I'm back and um, probably everyone in my town hates me now because, you know, probably. Let's see, a letter from Cole. He's just saying thank you for visiting and he sent me a gift. Okay, I'll see what that is. And another letter from Sparrow. Um, oh, thanking me for um, medicine when sick. Okay, that's nice. You know, when I actually play, I do sometimes do that. Let's see, Sparrow gave me a fresh tea, which I don't want because I don't wear the teas. Um, a steamroller, okay, from Cole. And let's see what else we're looking at. What is with my hair? What do I do to fix it? Is this my punishment? This is my punishment for not playing, isn't it? And then a letter from my dad. How are you doing? Made any friends? Eating enough? Your mom is always worrying about you. Okay. And that's gonna be... Red carnations. Well, I'll plant those. Um, in a different spot, not right there. How about... here. Okay, so yeah, um, it's a good thing I have a beautiful town because otherwise I would dread going into my house. But of course Animal Crossing found another way to punish me for not playing, so <laughs> we get to um, enjoy this lovely hairstyle for now. But look, my house is not a mess. No infestations. Do I have any? Um, no, I just have some junk to sell, alright. Wow. Um, my character looks awful! Also, every person I talk to today is going to yell at me for being away for so long. I just know it. Do clovers count as weeds? I don't really think of them as weeds, but the game probably counts them as weeds. Hello? Hmm? Carmia? You're still alive? Where have you been? You disappeared without saying anything, so everyone's been pretty worried, you know? I suppose everything's fine, as long as you're safe. Let's make sure to chat sometimes, bleh. Huh, he's not that mad. In Wild World, they got so mad at me when I didn't play. It was awful. Hey, Carmia, where, you, where have you been? Don't tell me. You were training alone on a mountaintop, right? Oh man, you should have invited me. I would have gone with you in a heartbeat, wahey. Well, no, I was not training alone on a mountaintop. I, I don't think I would enjoy that. They probably wouldn't have air conditioning. Or a Japanese grocery store. So, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do today. Probably, um, talk to more animals. <laughs> what? No way, Carnia! I thought you'd move to another town or something. No one's seen you here in a million years. Well, you better not put me through that again. I was worried sick about you, Carmia. Hmm? What's up, Arthur? I ran into Gruff the other day, and he said he was thinking of moving away from our happy town. I sure hope Gruff was just pulling my leg. Who would ever want to leave this place? Yes, with its mayor who goes, um, on vacation for a month. Why would you ever want to leave? I'm so dutiful. <laughs> and plants durians everywhere as a prank. <laughs> yep, I'm an excellent mayor. <laughs> Let's see what she's um, selling for extra now. All right, pearl oyster shells. I'm not gonna go to the tropical island. I think I still have that park project down at the bottom of um, the town and I need to pay that off. Oh, hello there, welcome. Um, hi, it's been a while. <laughs> no, I don't want to put anything up in this space. I just need to sell some stuff. 
gosh, my hair it looks awful. I don't know how to fix it. Maybe it'll be better tomorrow. Maybe it is my punishment. See, I just have some random stuff to sell. The lemons and a t-shirt. There we are. All right, I have a little bit more cash on hand now. Let's see, I, oh, I like that. I do like the regal bed, but I'm just not going for that style and, wait, no, I think I should get it. I'll do something with it someday. Right? I wanted to maybe create like a historic room in the um, museum one day, so if I don't use it in my house, I could use it in there. That's an idea. Let's just pick some more weeds. At this point, I should probably do some off-screen nonsense once I've spoken to a few more animals, right? Right. Picking and selling all the fruit, you guys don't need to see that. What you want to see is, I don't know. I mean, really, oh, um, no, 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 that's not what I do. How do I change? Here we are, how's that? that's how I change tools, okay. Is that still there? Yes. Can you catch it? Without killing the flowers? Maybe not. Nope. Wait, it's still there. Can you catch the fireflies? Surely you can catch the fireflies, but maybe I'm just bad at aiming the net. That could be it. Or it could be that they are actually impossible to catch. I don't know. I don't have my slingshot, so I actually can't get that present. I just saw it, but I can't catch it without finding the slingshot in time. I don't remember where I put the slingshot in my tool set. Sorry. <laughs> I don't really care. I think it's just the balloon items in there, and I'm not a big fan of those, so it doesn't really matter, right? Right! Oh, I do need my shovel. To get that. And then I'm gonna pay off some more of this. Um, to see how much is left. Hello, how much is left on the debt? Let's see. For the fountain, we still need... Um, okay, I can't pay it off all yet, but I'll just do some more. Let's pay 44k. Uh, no, I accidentally hit B. Whoops. <laughs> Let's do it correctly this time. I want to pay this off today and get it over with. Over with, but you know, having a construction project in the middle of this area is kind of awkward. Let's do 40k actually. So I have a little bit left on hand if I need it. Now we only need to pay off a little bit more, not much. Oh, very, very, very you went. I was going to talk to you after that. Huh? That face? Carmia? Dude, you left without saying a word to anyone. Where have you been hiding? It's been like one month since we saw you. There have been some crazy rumors. Like you were doing intense baseball training or seeking the best iced coffee. Intense baseball training? Baseball is the worst. I don't like any sports, but I especially don't like baseball. Anyway, glad you're all right. Welcome back. Hey, Akarnia. <laughs> Made you look, yo, yo, yo. Hey, Carmia, you're cool with- No, I'm not. Ugh. Well, <sighs> all right, because I'm going to go to the tropical island in a bit. I, I suppose I can. Ugh, lovely. <laughs> anyway, let's give her some of these. I think they technically count as weeds, do they? Not sure. I think they do. If they're not flowers, they probably count as weeds. Hello, Isabel. Hello, Mayor. Today is the summer solstice, so don't expect to see the, see the moon at all tonight. I've prepared a little something for the summer solstice. You curious to see what I came up with? They're letter shades. Seeing as how it'll remain so hot and bright all day, I figured these would come in real handy. Plus, they're the height of fashion. Are they? I have my doubts, but then I am very picky. Uh, I'm gonna take those off. 
Let's see, I think that's accessory. Yep. All right, my hair's a disaster, but you know, other than that. Isabel, do you have anything else to say? Today's the longest afternoon of the year. That makes it a great day for playing. Uh, sure, I paid summer, but anyway, no one asked me about that, did they? Let's see, um, anyone at home, or are they all out right now? I think everyone's out right now, okay. So I have to actually find them to talk to them. All right, um, just kind of wanted to talk to everyone quickly before I start doing all of my daily routine stuff. Oh, let's talk to Gruff. Yo, Carmia. Uh, good evening, right? So, what's up? Hey, take a look at this. Let's see, he has a letter. Oh, it's from me. Um, I was just giving him some fruit in that letter, so I didn't say anything important. <laughs> this is the first letter you ever sent me, right? I plan on keeping it forever. Yep, you'll never escape it. <laughs> oh, great. It wasn't a very um, heartfelt letter. Oh, well. <laughs> Hello, Flurry. Oh, I haven't seen you in forever. Did you go on vacation or something? I have lots that I want to talk to you about, so let's catch up soon, Powderpuff. All right. Actually, I just got a delivery that was addressed to Sparrow. I know I'll be con I'd be concerned if I didn't receive a package I was expecting. Sorry to ask, but I can't get away right now. Do you think you could take this to him, please? Sure. And you're so busy standing here by this pond. I'd really appreciate it if you could deliver it sometime today. Again, thanks for your help. All right. Again, what a busy schedule of standing by the pond. All right. Sparrow was somewhere around here unless he's moved a lot since then, which he might have. Now that goes. Actually, the animals really move around a lot. You're like, oh yeah, they were in this part of town. No, they're not anymore. run too much and create too many animal tracks, but it's so hard. Surely Spyro is not at home. No, 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 obviously not. He was right here. No, he's not. Hmm. Cookie's still in place, but that doesn't help me. Awkward. <laughs> Alright, I'm probably just gonna go um, do a few off-screen things then, because that is... It's gonna take me too long. Oh, I don't have a pitfall seed. Ah. Oh well, I'm gonna do a few things off-screen for now, and see you guys in a bit. Alright, I'm on Main Street now, and let's see... Um, Club LOL is not open. I don't know if it'll be open at all, because it's... Uh, is summer solstice technically a festival day, but also it's probably too early at 7 o'clock. Um, I'm not sure what there is to do. I think that the shoe store is open. Yes! Let's check that out. Hello, Chum. Crikey, it's the mayor. Here, in my shop. Welcome, miss. My name's Kix. I run this little shoe shop. Please have a look around. Alright, let's see, he sells, I guess these are socks and then these are shoes. Hmm, what are these? I can't even see. Orange sandals. Uh. Um, no. I'll, I'll pass on those. They're very basic. They don't, they're not really significantly different to what I already have. Sorry, kicks. Some other time. <laughs> Whoops. Although, I was kind of thinking of changing my clothes. I wonder... Which of the others do I currently have? Um, no, I only have two designs that I've currently saved. This one is more suited to autumn, so maybe not at the moment. Here we are, let's just keep that one on for now. I might do another QR code design outfit at some point, but not right now. Let's just take a 
look at what the Able Sisters have. I usually don't find anything, but I'll just take a look since it's been so long. Hello. Really? She has a gas mask, a, a weird mask, and I don't even know what those little things are. And um, a fencing mask, I guess, I don't want. And the kindergartner's, kindergartner's hat? Not really... Uh, she never has anything interesting. I know she does sell some nice things, but I never seem to see them. <laughs> Welcome. Hi. Um. Mm, mm. Bye. <laughs> The fashion is improved in this game, but once you start using the QR codes, you're sort of like, oh, maybe not. Maybe I'll just stick to the QR codes. Um, sorry. Hmm. I guess I can buy more flowers. <laughs> yeah, I... Know what I'm going to be doing for the rest of the game day or real life day actually for that matter <laughs> but we'll see probably just gonna do all the basic stuff around town that I haven't done in so long <laughs> hmm I do have a fossil to give to blabbers, but that's not the most exciting to show. I'm just going to see what's in the um, TNT Mart, and I think after I'm done with Main Street, I'm going to go to the Tropical Island, so we'll see how that goes. Hmm. Nothing too exciting as usual, although I do need to buy stuff sometimes, let's see what the furniture is. Oh, that's wrapping paper. I don't need wrapping paper unless I'm giving someone a gift. I'm not at the moment. A cheese floor? Okay, I have to see that. I don't want it, but I have to see it. Why? No, no. <laughs> Why? Why would you make that? I don't want the lab wall either. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to be heading off to a tropical island after this, so I will see you in a bit, again. <laughs> Gosh, my poor character looks awful. Where is there a salon in this game? I haven't unlocked it yet. <laughs> Alright, so I've completed another fossil, the Ichthyosaur. Ah, the Ichthyosaur is surely an amazing creature. You know, when it comes to the Ichthyosaur, what I love most is how Ah, I'm so sorry. My mind started to race with thoughts of the Ichthyosaur. Anywho, I promise we will take excellent care of it here. We'll add a detailed description as well, so please go take a look at the Ichthyosaur display soon. May I offer any further assistance? Not at the moment. You know, maybe I'll go check that out. I haven't checked um, the fossils in a while. Let's just see. I don't know where the Ichthyosaur is. That is such a strange name. Um, I'm guessing that's not this. I don't know what the Ichthyosaur is. <laughs> I just know it's something that's complete. It's not that one. That's something else. That's also something else. Triceratops. The Stega something. Um, Stegosaurus. It's been a while since I've brushed up on my dinosaur knowledge, so please forgive me for forgetting all of their names. It. Cool! Though they bear a striking visual similarity to dolphins, Ichthyosaurs were reptiles rather than mammals. Interestingly, adult specimens have been found with juvenile bones inside their abdominal cavities. This suggests that rather than laying eggs, Ichthyosaurs gave birth to live young in the water. Hmm. And that's going to be Archelon Giant Sea Turtle. Cool. Tortoise, whatever. Turtle. Tortoise. Tortoise of the land ones. <laughs> so I'm doing okay with the fossils. Um, not so much of the paintings because I don't always play when um, Red is in town, but the fossils I'm, I'm doing pretty well. Alright, time to go to the tropical island! And maybe even find something else to give to Blabbers? 
Who knows, maybe. So, I'm back from the tropical island and Gruff wants to talk about moving. I think I might have overstayed my welcome here in the good town of Plymouth, you know? It's about time I moved on. I'll be leaving on the 26th of this very month. Um, mm, he looks so happy. Yeah, I might be jumping the gun, but thanks for everything you've ever done for me. I hope you'll be friends with me for a little while longer, bleh. I mean, he looks so happy about it. If there was any hesitation, then I wouldn't tell him just go, but he looks happy about it. So maybe he just wants to move somewhere else. Maybe he wants to move to a town with a mayor who actually shows up more than once a month. Oh, come on, who actually knows who the mayor of their city is? Maybe if you lived in, like, New York City, but other than that, <laughs> I don't know who the mayor of where I live is. That's not normal. People don't know who the mayor is where they live. It's sort of like how you don't know who the principal of your school is until they stop you in the hallway to bully you. That, that happened to me once. Anyway, <laughs> so I'd have a few more things to sell from the tropical island. I made a lot of money. It's actually quite funny, the tropical island is still following normal time, so it was dark there, or like twilight. Meanwhile, uh, it's sunny here. I should have recorded the trip there and back, but oh well. Because it was quite funny having the time change in such an awkward way. But hey, ugh, running, causing more animal tracks. I don't know how to avoid it though, because who wants to walk everywhere? Look, it's so slow. <laughs> That's one of my other complaints about Animal Crossing. Beyond punishing you for not playing regularly, they also punish you for wanting to run. How is that normal? You can't give people a run button in a video game and then punish them for using it. It would be like if Pokemon punished you for using the run button in um, Gen 3 when you can run. It's the reason so many ROM hacks include running in Generations 1 and 2, because we all wanted it so badly. All right, I just have a whole bunch of stuff, stuff to sell here. I have, I'm gonna get up really high in my money, that's great. And I'm going to go pay some of it off to um, my house debt because I've already paid off the fountain. All right, so that's looking good. 93K, I'm gonna go do that now. Oh wait, it's 8.52, they're probably the bank. Wait, no, it's at the bank and the bank is still open, right? At eight, probably. It's confusing when it's still light out. You can't tell that it's evening. <laughs> I have this problem a lot nowadays, actually, now that it's summer in Detroit. It's like, well, it's sunny, so how am I supposed to know that it's nearly nine o'clock? The post office, somewhere I don't usually go because I usually don't think about letters. Whoops. It's so hard typing in this game. Right, I'm curious how much I still have of my loan to pay off. Um, I have 248k left. Okay, that's a lot. I'm going to pay off 90k because I'm actually going to do a little bit of fishing on the beach still, so I'll make a little more cash after that. Gosh, my hair is awful today. This episode is going to be titled Bad Hair Day. I've called it. <laughs> You know, something I've never done. I think I'll end the episode off. I'll go to LOL. I've never gone to Club LOL on a, um, a day besides Saturday. So I will do that in a little bit, in a little bit, because that way we can see what it's like. I think if you give a uh, fruit to, um, to Dr. Is it Dr. Shrunk or Dr. Slump? Oh dear, I've forgotten. Anyway, I think if you give him a fruit, then he'll tell a joke for you. Something like that. So I shall probably pick some fruit. <laughs> Where are there some apple trees? Here's an apple tree. I will say, Animal Crossing is a very relaxing game to play. Right, anything on the beach? It seems like you don't really get different things at the tropical island depending on the time of year because I just keep finding all the same fish and stuff over and over. That's a little bit disappointing in a way, but what can you do? Only thing I... I know I haven't caught the shark. I just cannot get the timing on the sharks right. I don't know if I ever will. So that will 
Blavers will never get to have a shark in the museum, but you know, sharks don't do well in captivity except for some of the smaller ones, so it's fine, right? I mean, if I caught it and gave it to Blavers, it would probably just die. And it's mostly great whites, but don't like captivity, isn't it? Anyway, <laughs> let's see if we can catch some more not sea bass. Spoke too soon. <laughs> to catch a few more fish and then I'll wind down the day by checking out Club LOL. Oh, let's... What was that angle? There's no way the fish is going to go for it. <laughs> Does that look better? Yes. Ah, oh, it's just a horse mackerel. Oh well, better than a sea bass, right? Actually, mackerel is really good. If you ever go to a Japanese restaurant which has um, shio saba, which is like a salted mackerel, it's really delicious. You should try it. All right, this tiny one might be something valuable. Maybe a horse. Um, yes, a seahorse. I was gonna say horsey. <laughs> Not a horsey. Oh no. Well, that's not nice. Oh well. I'm just going to mm, do one or two things before I go to Club LOL, so I will see you in a minute. All right, so here is the club on a weekday that KK is just DJing rather than performing live. So, if you like dancing, I hope you really just let your hair down and have a great time. So, my character is kind of just head bopping. <laughs> I did not mean to do that, I accidentally took a photo. No one else here. That's very quiet. I wonder why. Oh, I was hoping that you could maybe talk to him and he'd tell you what song he's playing, you know, if you're curious, but I guess not. Well, this is my kind of club. There's no one here. <laughs> no crowds. Also very easy to social distance in a club like this. <laughs> See? We all have many, many meters between us. <laughs> Alright, so with my horrible bed head, I'm just going to rave away in this club for a little bit. And that will be that for this evening. Well, I hopefully will not have another month away from playing like this because that was a bit bad. Fortunately, none of the animals hate me too much for it, although Gruff is moving out, but maybe he just wanted to move anyway. Maybe it's not my fault, right? <laughs> so, I will hopefully play again sooner. I want to see what the new um, fountain is going to look like in the southern part of town. I'd like to build a little park set up there. I think it'll be really cute. So next time we can have a little unveiling ceremony for that and see about what new project I want to start on in town after that. As always, thank you so much for watching and please stay safe. I hope that everyone's getting their vaccine. Um, if you don't live in the States, I hope that you have the vaccine available where you live. I know that different countries' governments are not all doing the best job of distributing the vaccine, so I hope that you guys can get it. And um, that's about all for today. Until next time, bye-bye.